I'm sitting here at uh, the console of the museum's 1927 Robert Morton Theater Pipe Organ. The organ was first installed in the Old Mill Theater in Dallas's Theater Row on Elm Street. After the silent movie era and the organ came out of the theater, it went to a funeral home in Austin. Then it went to a private collector in Victoria, Texas, ultimately made its way back to Dallas, and was installed in Dallas's iconic uh, Deco Lakewood Theater. The organ was removed in about 2003 from the theater when flooding came up and got the console and the lift for the second time, and the organ has been in storage ever since. The group that had the organ realized that they weren't going to find another home for it in the Dallas area, and so the organ curatorship was uh, deeded over to the museum here in McGregor. This is going to be one of our central exhibits. It's going to be a live operating exhibit, and anyone that wants to come in and try it out is going to be welcome to do so. The console that I'm sitting at is kind of like the tip of the iceberg. The actual organ itself, the instrument, is going to be in two chambers built in the back of the building. It's going to house somewhere between 10 and 12 tons of gear that actually produces the music. It's going to be a 10 horsepower blower to generate enough air pressure to run this instrument. Restoring and installing all that tons of musical gear to make the pipe organ operate is going to take a couple of years. In the meantime, we don't want the console languishing with nothing to do, so in the interim we're going to equip the console with digital or virtual theater organ voices so that we've got something to play and for people to hear and enjoy in the meantime. It's going to take literally thousands of man hours to restore all of the components that make up the pipe organ and we earnestly would enjoy having anyone that would like to get their hands in we'd love to have you come down be a part of the restoration process we have tasks that can be done by big burly men or the finest and daintiest of ladies we have things that everybody can do to contribute if you'd like to uh, get more information on that give us a call or drop an email We'd be glad to tell you what's going on.